Good afternoon folks, 21st Century Caveman here. Hope everybody's well, hope everybody's happy. So we're doing some boxing in today. So there is the soil pipe coming from the loo upstairs. The other evening I started um, putting some framework in and just trying to sort of like level everything out basically. So this was um, covered, it was boxed in using six millimeter plywood. Um, you know, it, it was in sort of three or four pieces, so I just decided to strip the whole lot out basically. I'm certainly not faffing around trying to take the paper off of this. However, these old strips here, you know, the wood underneath, the timber underneath, is pretty decent nick actually, to be honest with you. But, you know, rather than having three or four different lengths in there, or sizes rather, and bring them together and try and make them fit where the joints are properly so you can't really see them. I'm not, I'm not bothering basically. So look, I bought another sheet, an eight by four sheet um, of six millimeter ply. And what I'm going to do is to use the old strips as templates to measure out. So I'm just gonna draw around the edges there and uh, just do some fine tuning rather than having to sort of, you know, measure the stuff out again. There's no point at all. So I'm just going to draw around um, the offcuts there and try and get it to fit better, but more importantly, in one piece. So the frame is now a lot more substantial than what it was. To try and bring it out to the right um, depth, I've nailed some 6mm plywood to this breeze block wall here. It's very, 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 very sturdy. And it's brought it out to you know, the right distance from the wall and also it's nice and plumb and flat um, to enable the board to, you know, be fixed um, across this area down here and obviously, you know, we're going to wang a bit up the side there as well. Right, so we're pretty much there with this now. So before I actually pin or fix anything, I'm going to put the side panel in because I want this top sheet to cover the edge 
of the side panel if that makes sense. So we've got a little bit of an overlap here. I still need to trim it down a little bit. So I thought I'd put in the side panel, um, trim it, fix it into place, and then finish off by placing this on here. And basically what it means is that the edge of the side panel will be covered by the front panel. Right, okay, before I fit this, actually what I'm going to do, because we've got that quite noticeable gap up there, which will need to be filled with caulk, um, I'm going to take the board back by about 10 mil, something like that. Do the same over here. Take it back about 10 mil, so the board, so I can basically push it a bit further up which will make it easier to fill this gap here because it's going to be some board going further into that void. But I'll do that in a bit when I fix the side panel. So the project is now complete. It may not be the best bit of carpentry you'll ever see in your life, but it's not the worst either. So um, these pipes, this saw pipe has now been boxed in. It's absolutely rock solid. Um, I've sanded down the edges. I've got the best fit I can within my skill set. Any little areas like this look. Um, I'm just going to fill them in with some plaster when I skim the ceiling. I've just um, tacked the panels in using some little uh, panel pins. So that's absolutely solid now. Um, on the edge down the bottom there, um, I made a slight error miscalculation in cutting the board. So there's a little gap down there, which I'm going to put some wood filler in, but you know, realistically, you're not going to notice it unless you look for it. Um, there's going to be a little bit of skirting board at the bottom there. So basically, this job is now completed. It's been a very enjoyable few hours at the property, just doing my own thing, having a little bit of um, time to myself. Um, yeah, just pottering around really, cutting a bit of wood banging a few pins in, uh, you know, it's been good. I've enjoyed it. It's been a very nice day outside. And um, I'd like to say thank you very much indeed for joining me. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.